super cool. Today we're going to be teaching you about frogs. Oh, he just jumped. Here he is. This is actually um one of we have a pond down there, and um actually um I think this frog came from a pond because um. Darren found it right by a basketball hoop over there, and it was about to jump. The frog that we caught today is called a Pacific tree frog. And it is actually um, little right now. He it just, is, it he is just opened his not mouth. actually um, a grown-up now. It's it might of, be a grown-up, yeah. actually. Because they only grow to two inches. So, um, we made a habitat for the frog, and we put just, like, sand, and we kind of put some, like, water and, um, the stuff from a pond, and that's the frog kind of hiding, and we put some of this, like, wood and some, like, leaves for, like, the details on it. Pacific tree frogs in grassy areas in your backyard pond and you can find them like wood areas. The way we identified this was a Pacific tree frog was that um, the dark stripe on its eye ah! and it can be bronze brown and it can also and they can also be um Brain. They can change color seasonally. Ah! Frogs are wet. Toads are dry. Frogs are smooth. Toads are warty. <laughs> Frogs have long legs. Toads have short legs. Frogs live for 10 years. Toads live for 50 years. So we made a pond with the kids in the backyard and we used a barrel. This is a barrel made out of like a plastic rubber material that we got at a hardware store. We used some gravel that was lying around so we covered the bottom with gravel. We used some old planters to um, create these plants um, that go into the water but sit a little bit higher. Um, and we also got some plants here from a, a nearby pond that we added. And also these small plants from a local fish store so that when we did put tadpoles in, they have food to eat. They can eat the plants, they can eat the algae. Um, and we also created these rocks kind of as ladders so that when the tadpoles turn into frogs, they can climb out of our pond. It's good to have a pond in your um, backyard to help um, frogs have a safe environment so that um, they can grow. We found some eggs in our pond. We don't know if they're frog eggs though. Might be our snail egg. And there are a bunch of them. A bunch over here. And they might be tadpole eggs, but we don't really know. Might be frog eggs, they might be snail eggs. Frogs can lay up to um a thousand eggs. Frogs eat snail slugs and worms and they close their eyes to suck the prey down. Um, frogs um, don't drink water, they um, absorb it through their skin. 
their boots and um, webbed feet help them to jump. Goodbye! You found a frog? <gasps> Whoa! Put him in the container! Another oh. frog! Froggy! <laughs> oh, he's one of the little green ones! He caught him! Darren caught a frog! When he was still looking for a spider, Darren caught a frog! Wow! Today we're going to be teaching you about uh, Frogs. What are you Frogs. <laughs> <laughs> you can find the chip. Frogs are wet and toads are not wet. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> <laughs> toads are warty. <laughs> Okay, Darren, do it. <laughs>